evening ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another video. Um been going back to this uh being seem to be drawn, sorry, to this abandoned farm. I don't know why, but something's telling me to come back. Um see the problem is I don't know why I've been told to come back here, why I've been drawn back to here again, but we're gonna have another look anyway. Might as well. You know, the wind. It's really windy again. It's full of moths. Big ones. I'm not liking this because it's too moffy. Seem to get covered in moths if you don't watch it. See, uh, we're not supposed to be allowed in here because it's all been sealed off so many times. Um, someone smashed it up at uh, the house, which I'll show you again in a minute. But we're not really allowed in here. I think. down. I'm not quite sure what they're going to do with it, but the idea is that they're going to pull it down. They're going to rebuild houses on the site of their farm. Um, I just thought I'd come back having a look. You know, see what it's like you know, a few months later and to, my, to be honest, I don't think it's changed it's just that it looks really different on an evening and I know that door there's shut that door was open you know, there's all this in here, look, this little coat hook for this hang uh, the horses leashes Graffiti already. Alt hooks, nails, and lights that's still up there. It's the way the birds, there's birds flying about still. And moths. To be honest, in here, there's really, really big moths. The old lights. I'm not liking it because there's moths. And me and moths don't get along. At all. Um, there was something down here that I saw. Look at all the cobwebs. Come on. I don't really want to go in here because I know there's going to something jump out at me again. Can you hear the wind? It's really windy. But that's the roofing. 
really windy again, as you'll know in a minute when I go back out. Um, yes, bird poo. Look at the birds, look. If anybody knows what these birds are, please let me know. Uh, drop, drop me a message at the bottom and uh, it'd be appreciated. I think they're scared of the light. Right, anyway, we'll leave you alone, birds. So you can just let me out. That's one out. That's me out. So yeah, um, that was that. So basically, as you've just seen, there's a lot of birds still flying about around there. And um, the problem is I don't like birds. They scare me. I don't know why, but I just don't like them. See, this wasn't like this. Look. This is now overgrown. I think for a minute, all this has been redone up again so nobody can get in. But I'll give you a little shore rot of the house. This is what it looks like now. This is the house that I uh, caught orbs in not long ago and in the living room actually I caught a lot of little flying little orbs if you go back to the previous videos you'll actually find it there is orbs flying around in the living room now putting it in perspective I pointed the camera afterwards with the light on down at the floor there were no dust, no nothing but in this house what I was told is that a family died one after each other I don't know if it's true uh, I'll have to have a look it up and see what it states but um, I'll let you know I'll let you know on that one but this is it now they've reboarded the windows upstairs which the windows wasn't boarded last time they boarded the door down here and they've re-tinned up these windows and they put another two lots of tin on this window here and I don't know why they've done that but this is the hedging for the garden it would have been a lovely garden if it was all up and running but it looks like it's not anymore but I think I'm stuck here we'll see you see the tin this one as well stop us from getting in but I look at Joe look look at Joe having a fag just find the same place so you can have a look and he's been getting apples there's a wave Joe there's a wave there you go there's Joe and yeah so They've done these tin, re re tin these up, they've done this door. The upstairs here, sorry, you can still see that's still open. Um, all this is still tin down here. There's no more tin in down there. That's Joe there, look. Been buying apples. Um, yeah, so. Also, is that the bin? The bit sort of like something which I get into this tin in here. Look, as you can tell, someone's been trying to pull this off. Don't know why, because it's all nailed up anyway. So if it's all nailed up, how is someone going to get into that? But as I said, we've just been—we've not been here that about two or three times, but something keeps telling me to come back. I don't understand why. But it keeps telling me. This is the old barn where they used to keep the machinery. Um, it used to hold maximum of 
uh, five to six machines all at once and this what I've just been in this area here this area here was the stables where they used to keep the horses on an evening and this is where they used to keep the hay bales now what I've been told is that they're going to pull this down to make more houses I don't understand why but because I think it's a great farm well I, when I grew up here in Selby itself they had a really good farm going with it and now they're going to pull it down but yes um, the police do try to stop us from coming they do try and you know when somebody pulls a board off you know uh, they come back and fill it up they tin it all back up again so we can't do it but the problem also is with me is that I like now to go and explore to go in you know I'll risk a police officer coming you know we're not doing it wrong we're just looking we're just having a nosy you know we've never been to these places we've never been in we've never nosied so curiosity killed the cat I say but as I've said before, you know, we're not hurting anybody. See? We're not hurting anybody. Even the pigeon, even the birds agree. So back in against both mates. This is not normal. I swear that the birds know that I hate them. But still come in, look. Amazing. Comes in and brings his mates with him. That'll find its way out. But yes, so in a nutshell, this is what it's like, you know, it's dark, it's abandoned, it's, de it's derelict or nothing, but anywho, as I've always said, you know, is that if you feel like going exploring, you've got a phone or a camera or anything like that, just get your shoes and coat on. Well, I'm going to have a nose. So, ow. Trip wire. Trip wire. This wasn't here earlier. This is new. That's new. So, it's the trip wire over there. Now, the fence in there. What's next? Oh, they've smashed the drain pipe. Ooh. Ah! And the drain pipe up there broke. So. <sighs> Just the way, So anyway, if you like what you see and you like the videos that I produce, don't forget to uh, subscribe, comment and don't forget to smash that like button. And also just to inform you that I have a YouTube account um, so you can, you can uh, apply and you know, send me a message basically telling me that if you like it, what could be improved, what could you, you know, what, what you think of the video and also I have a Facebook page if you want to go on it all you've got to do is type in Darren Heels and go onto my picture and don't forget to uh, add me as a friend on there so from me to you and from probably from you to me I'll say one thing to you have a great evening or morning or afternoon it depends where you are in the world and don't forget, subscribe.
and comment.